Well, Olympians are usually celebrated for their athletic ability. Now, some might be praised for a very different talent. NBC 5's Benny Nazai is in Lake Placid with the story. Visitors come to Lake Placid to take in the village's Olympic history and sporting events, but now there's something else they can enjoy. Former British Olympic javelin thrower Ruald Bradstock is one of many former Olympians with artwork on display at Lake Placid's Olympic Center. He appreciates having the chance to share something people might not expect from world-class competitors. But this is where uh, giving our Olympians and Paralympians uh, a platform to show their other, another side of them, to show their, their creativity. And, you know, it's, it's a different way of expressing yourself and it's kind of, you're kind of removed. Um, but yeah, it's a great honor, especially to be in an um, Olympic facility. Through the efforts of ORDA, the Al Order Foundation, and the organization Art of the Olympians, artwork by former Olympic athletes is on display at the Olympic Center in Lake Placid. The mission was started in May and is now being executed. Olympic Authority board members are excited about the exhibits. The opportunity to use another part of one's brain toward artistic impression is not only healthy, but can also be very rewarding when seeing tangible creations. Orta President and CEO Ashley Walden says the works will give visitors something other than sports to enjoy. This also provides an opportunity for those that might not be uh, normally interested just in sport alone to come here to experience um, art. The Owl Order Foundation was founded to honor the former Olympic discus thrower and to build character and integrity through sports and the arts. Order passed away in 2007, but his widow says he would be proud of this occasion. He would be beaming. He would absolutely be beaming because this is a home where he could embrace. There's also artwork that can be seen at the Olympic Jumping Complex at Mount Van Hovenberg. In Lake Placid, Benny Nazai, NBC5 News.